Hey folks, Matthew Boxler here, and I am with my friend Carrie Russell Bates. Hey there. And uh, Carrie had uh, been asking me about body processes and what they are and how they work. And she's a bars facilitator. Maybe I'll turn it over to you at that point. Yeah, thank you. Mm -hmm. We're here at Starbucks in our um, Pacific Northwest field behind us here, and we just wanted to say hi and. Um, yeah, I became a bars facilitator a year and a half or so ago, so I've been teaching classes for the last year. And Matt did a workshop with us last Friday, and I started quite having questions about body processes because I, I did foundation, but there were a lot of things that uh, I hear people talk about in whether it's um, on Facebook or the Google Hangouts, and so I get bits and pieces of other information, and so I was really curious to learn a little bit more. So I just asked Matt some basic questions about body processes, and he had so such amazing um, explanations that I thought would be really helpful to hear it um, from you and just to find out just in general what what they really are mm -hmm. <laughs> and mm -hmm. the purpose of them and what what we do um, when we take classes and why you recommend sure classes. yeah yeah thanks for that um, well a little background on me a lot like um, a lot of the people in the Portland area I've noticed there's a lot of body workers there's a lot of energy workers and light workers and I notice a lot of people like myself have been through many different modalities to find something that works for them. And the one thing, Carrie, that was different about the access body processes is that you don't actually have to put any energy into the body you're working with or receive any energy or pick up any juju or anything weird. You know, it's all about acknowledging that bodies have their own sense um, and awareness of what they require if you're willing to actually allow them to bring that uh, that brilliance that intelligence it's like body intelligence out and so um, the body processes there's about 50 different processes and they're hands-on processes where you are paired up with another person and you put your hands on them and just ask for a particular process to run. Now, you don't have to know anything. Um, hey, there's Paula. Hey, Paula. Um, you don't have to know anything to do this. And if you do have skills with energy, it's all, it's even the better. But um, basically asking these processes to run, what they do is they change all of the things that we've picked up as children and uh, in earlier parts of our lives where we were totally trusting of the people around us to do the best thing and just took it for granted that they loved us and they had their, their best interests in whatever you know was going on for our own betterment. And how many times have we looked back and we had a point of view from like somebody we grew up with that we realized, wow, that's not really working for me, but I feel really stuck with it. Has that happened for no, you before? Not at all. Yes. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> me too. Absolutely. Um, the body processes allow those things just to like leave your body just by putting your hands on them and asking one of these 50 processes to, uh, to run. Yeah, one of the most common questions I get asked when I'm running bars, or I, with taking foundations, I learned the MTVSS process and a couple other things, is people's concern about taking things on. Mm. Like bars, and, and when you mentioned that, that the these body processes, you don't take things on by just being that person, that conduit for the person that you're, that's receiving from you. So right. that was just incredible, just that relief, sense of relief that people feel knowing that they're not taking anything on, they're just being there for the, for yeah. the body. Yeah, that's really big. The body processes don't, you don't have to be a container, you don't have to be a conduit, you just like touch them and receive. And bodies have their own magic awareness. Um, bodies have like a source of consciousness that we don't have as a beings. I mean, that's why we're having bodies, right? right. I mean, why did you come to Earth? Yeah. To have a body? Have Was a that body, one of the reasons? Right. Yeah, right. <laughs> yeah, now we're, you know, through our processes, we may find we're trying to fight our body or change our body or fight off other bodies, you know? But in the body process, um, medium, 
there's a place where none of that matters anymore and you just put your hands on them and your body as the practitioner, as the giver, the gifter, actually gets to receive the changes of the person that you're working on too. And um, you know, worst case scenario, afterwards you feel great. And best case, you know, your whole life starts to change or the way you be with your body starts to change. So how much better does it get than that? Yeah, amazing. Looking forward to your, um, in Portland we're having a couple classes this upcoming weekend on the 15th and 16th, so I'm very much looking forward to participating in um, both of those body process classes. So yeah. this will be very exciting to focus just on bodies, just on the processes that we can mm. learn to, to give. Isn't others. it cool that yeah. you have a body of your own? <laughs> yes. Right? Yeah. She's yeah. got her own body. How cool is that? <laughs> right? Well, anyway, if you guys want to know more, stay tuned. We'll be doing some more videos this week. Um, maybe even do a little live Zoom so you guys can get your questions in as, as body workers and people looking for a different possibility. So join us later. Thanks, folks. Bye. How much better does it get than that? <laughs>